Hey, it's Lenny McGill with the Glock Store Performance and Custom Shop here in San Diego, California. And you know the laws around leaving your firearm available for an individual to have access to, to gain access to who's not authorized, i.e. a child, i.e. a burglar, i.e. a mentally uh, incompetent person, uh, i.e. someone who commits suicide. I mean, just you go on and on. But the laws surrounding that are becoming more and more punitive every day. So it is up to us as gun owners to have secure measures to secure our firearms so they do not fall into those unauthorized hands. Because now it's not just a problem and not just a tragedy, it's also a, a penalty to you, whether it be a, a lawsuit, whether it be a, a criminal case, and whether you actually you know, lose the right to hold and, and store firearms or to own firearms or even go to jail. So it, it's a real important aspect of gun ownership. And most of us, myself included, and probably half the people out here watching, have a gun safe of some sort. And I recommend a gun safe of some sort, of course. And there are many different safes we sell. We sell little small safes on our, uh, on our website. Uh, and they're, you know, they're kind of personal safes. Uh, they're, they're better than nothing, okay? And of course, you know, if you, at the end of the day, you always want to get a big safe too, a big old box you know, that's you know, 800 pounds that has a combination lock or a push button lock on it that allows you to store your firearms and put them away from unauthorized people. The challenge that we all have with this method of storage is that, well, the gun's locked up and, you know, what good does it do me? How do I get to it quickly? You know, and, and what do I do, you know, in case something happens right now and it's locked in a safe and I got to go up there and do that or push the buttons and, and, and gain access? Well, you know, here's the bad guy. You know, the absolute concept of being able to manage that gun on a day-to-day -day basis is, is really where this whole thing falls apart. Um, so, I mean, if you have your guns and you, you want to store it in your safe, and you say, okay, and uh, uh, at nighttime when you know someone may break in the house, I'm going to open up the safe. I'm going to pull the gun out. I'm going to put it here, and I know where it's at. And you know, I'm, I've got well, I'm with an eye shot of it, or I know that it's you know kind of secure. I got it. I understand. Okay, but now the next day, I've got to remember to put it back in the safe. And you know, you go through that process, you know, for a month or two, and you're going to kind of you know like, oh, this, this is no fun. Uh, small safe, same way, you know, I mean, you know, it's a little bit maybe easier to access. Uh, maybe, you know, there in your bed, you can pop it up and there's a lot of push button safes that are very convenient. Uh, but again, uh, you know, you've got to remember to put that thing back away. Um, so, you know, there's a scenario and, you know, what's the solution? Well, there is a new product that's out that's been out for a little while. Uh, this is the second video I'm going to do on it because I, it's, it's so strong and so effective that, um, uh, I think it's worth talking about again, especially with the new laws that are coming out. California has some crazy laws they're trying to get to that, you know, re or pertain to that if you own a gun, you must keep it in a safe. I mean, no matter what, no matter what, I mean, if you walk in, no matter who you are, you have to keep it in a safe at, at all times. It's like, well, but how do you use it for self-defense if at all times it has to be in a, in, a, in a locked case? So this is a great solution for a lot of these problems I just talked about. It's called the Adenolock, and um, it's activated by your fingertip. So it's kind of a biometric style safe. Uh, and basically, uh, it, it's a big boot that goes over the trigger guard. You cannot gain access to the trigger. You can't take it off. I mean, you could probably beat it off with a hammer. Uh, you know, certainly, you know, but how long is that going to take? Uh, it's not something that someone's going to pick up and, and be able to do something stupid with right away. They're, they've got to think about it. However, <laughs> you've got the ability to gain access to the gun instantly with, once it's programmed with your fingertip. Like that, okay? Just that quick. Pop it in and lock it. Just that quick. I mean, so now, all of a sudden the solution to what we just talked about is how do you manage that gun on a day-to-day -day basis? Well, you can literally store this in your nightstand and be safe because you cannot fire it unless it works on your fingertip. Just that quick. All right. So now, a couple things about this. Uh, it, it obviously could still be stolen if your home was broken into. But that's a separate issue altogether. 
we're talking about the ability to be able to manage the guns and keep them safe from your children, uh, from a burglar who just walks in and picks it up and may injure you with, uh, from anything that crazy could happen in your house. Now, you know, whoever picks up the gun has to be programmed to be able to operate it. And programming is simple. It does hold up to three different codes, by the way. So you can program it for yourself, you can program it for your wife, and perhaps for someone else, or you can put another finger in there too in case you damage one of your fingers, <laughs> just in case. Uh, the programming is fairly easy. It's a very simple process. There's a full set of instructions that come with it. Uh, this thing is pretty cool. It's very high tech, it's very effective. Now you can put a gun in your living room in a dresser drawer in your living room or, or one of your uh, uh, coffee table drawers or somewhere even in the kitchen. That's relatively available. So if someone were to inadvertently open up, they would see it, but they couldn't do anything with it. They couldn't fire it because they don't have access. So now all of a sudden, bad guys at your door, you have access to the gun, push it and off it goes just that quick. It's so easy to operate and so quick uh, and so effective to uh, protect the gun, the trigger from being shot, you know, by someone who shouldn't have it. I mean, it's really, this, this is a, a great device. And I'm telling you what, uh, we, uh, we've tested them on different style Glocks. Uh, it works with, you know, all the nine millimeters works with the 45 calibers. Uh, it's uh, going to go ahead and um, uh, this one is actually made for Glock. So it's really kind of a, uh, a perfect solution. If you have a Glock and you're looking for a way to be able to transport your gun, even in the car. Think about it from there. You know, you've got a gun, you, you know, what are you gonna do with it? Well, you know, and, and there's certain laws and every state has their own laws and all that other stuff. But the last thing you wanna do is, you know, have it readily accessible in case someone were to break in and, and, and take it or, or they were uh, uh, to uh, uh, be able to access the gun somehow and, and you don't really want them to. Well, now the only person who's gonna operate that is you with your fingertip and it's this quick. I mean, it's just not, you know, it's not even something you think about once you get it done. Uh, it's, a, it's a rechargeable battery in here. You charge it you know, every three months, they say. It charges right off your computer with a USB cable or any other USB style outlet. You put your little Apple uh, charger in there and you can, you can plug it off the wall as well. Uh, it's got a key lock to override it. So if the battery ever dies, you can always override it. And the key lock actually uh, is, is integral to helping you uh, reset or reprogram uh, the fingertips that make this thing operate. Uh, it's pretty darn robust. Um, you know what? We've sold a bunch of them so far, and everybody loves them. I've got them in my house. That's how much I like this thing. Because I want to be able to access the gun when something happens. I want to be able to put a gun down in the living room, real close to the TV, where if I'm sitting there watching TV, in my desk, if I'm, you know, uh, uh, working at the computer. And I want a gun available, but I don't want it to be available. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I, I want it there, but I don't want it to be operable unless I need it. And so hence, it's that fast. So that's kind of how I've been using it. You know, like I said, I've got one in my office, in a drawer. It's sitting there just like that. I've got one in the TV room, in a drawer, sitting there just like that. So I know that, hey, if uh, something is busted, if I'm sitting there on a Saturday night just relaxing, watching some movies, and all of a sudden someone's busted in my door, the last thing I'm gonna try to do is run up to the safe room and, and open up the, uh, uh, the safe. You know, it's just impractical. And I don't wanna have one of those box safes sitting around, you know, because they take up too much space, they're kinda hard to fit in a drawer. This fits in the drawer and this works. So there's so many reasons that this thing is a good tool. Now they're not like cheap, you know, this is, this is a, a pretty high tech piece of technology that, uh, you know, is uh, you know, well made and, and works well. But the bottom line is, uh, if you can see the need for this, I'd say, you know, pick them up. And uh, it's one of those things where, you know, like I said, we've sold several thousand of these already. Everybody loves them. They work great. They do what they're supposed to do. And at the end of the day, it's gonna give you peace of mind that you're gonna love because you know you can get the gun and you know it's available. Now, I even had some people tell me uh, uh, through the internet, we were talking about them, and one uh, woman has one uh, around her gun like this and she actually keeps it behind uh, a, um, uh, pillows on her sofa. So she's sitting on the sofa, she's got access to it. That's the kind of creativity you know, that you can do because now you know that it's not just a gun back there, it's a locked gun. But the only person who will unlock it is you with your fingertip. 
and it's available. So if she's there and she's got her grandchildren over, she's not worried about them finding it. Yeah, of course, she doesn't want them to find it. She's got it hidden away, quote unquote, down into the, uh, uh, the, um, uh, the cushions. But if someone's breaking in and she's sitting there, she can get access to it and she can unlock it with just a touch of the button. It's that good. It's that fast. It's that effective. And like I said, I use it and I think you should too. I'm Lenny McGill. This, of course, is the Glock Store Performance and Custom Shop right here in San Diego, California. If you're ever in town or you come by the shop, you can see how this thing works in person. Uh, but I guarantee you, when you pick one up and you take it at home, you're going to be able to operate it easy. It's just very simple to set up and very effective to secure your Glocks. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.